Yo, what is going on YouTube and welcome back to another YouTube video here on my channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you'll be able to get 5 tryhard mounted outfits after the patch with 50, also known as a casino DLC. The way this glitch, it will delete all your outfits, so I suggest that you wear an outfit that you don't want to lose. And if you don't mind losing all your outfits and getting back 5 mounted outfits, then I really suggest that you do this glitch. And yeah, let's get straight into the glitch. So the first thing you want to do is head over to the nearest clothing store. So I'm going to head over to the nearest clothing store. The reason I'm going to the clothing store is because you're going to have to delete all your outfits. So you can make your way over to the clothing store gun store. It doesn't matter. I'm going to head over to the gun store because it's right down the street over here for me. So I'm almost here. Right. So once you guys make your way to the gun store, clothing store, and anywhere where you can access clothing, all you're going to do is just head inside and just delete all your outfits. So click right on the D-pad and click and type in, I mean, delete all of them. So just delete, delete, delete. So wear an outfit that you don't mind losing. I mean, wear an outfit that you want to keep. So for me, it's going to be this outfit here. So once you guys deleted all your outfits, the first thing you want to do is click pause, head over to online, and then hit, go down to swap character and click X on it. You guys are on this screen right here as you guys can see my male character is in my first slot head over to your second slot character if your male character is not in the first slot then this glitch will not work for you so make your way over to your second slot character click x to start editing this character so you're gonna have to wait a little bit it's gonna give you like this little scheme it flicks you off and then it's gonna ask you if you guys want to copy the rank click x to copy the rank on this character so once you guys are on the screen right here you're gonna want to make sure it's a female so turn it to the female, but if it's a female, leave it the way it is. So once you guys have it as a female, click save and continue. Type in a name. You can put any name. It doesn't matter. And just take a picture. So once you guys did everything that I just did, you're going to go to a casino cutscene. So I'll be back once I'm done with the casino cutscene. So once you guys spawn in after doing a casino cutscene, you guys should spawn into an online session. What you guys want to do is click pause on the map and look for the nearest clothing store. So if you guys don't have the clothing stores like I don't, it's super, it's okay, it doesn't matter, it's super easy. What you want to do is click pause and then head over to online and just find the new session. So I'll be back once I'm in a new session. So once you guys find the new session, all you want to do is open up your interaction menu and enable passive mode so nobody will be able to kill you while you're doing this glitch. So once you guys hit that, click pause and look for the nearest clothing store for, thank god the clothing store is right here. So just make your way over to the nearest clothing store, so I'll be back once I'm at the clothing store. Okay, so once you guys made your way to the clothing store, the first thing you want to do is just head inside. So make your way inside, and the first thing you want to do is take off any accessories. So I'm going to take off this ugly hat that I have on, so let me just take it off real quick. I'm going to take off any hats, jewelry, cuffs, gloves, earrings, anything like that. So I'm going to head over to accessories and just take off any accessories I have. So I have no chains, no earrings. Okay, I have nothing. Okay, I have a necklace. Okay, so once you guys take off all the accessories, the first thing that you want to do is head over to gloves and then buy what the light wooden tactical. It's number four out of number 54, so it looks like these. So once you guys bought these gloves, next thing you want to do is just back out of that. Now once you guys did that, make your way over to pants. So right now we're, we're making the first outfit. So make your way over to pants. And then once you guys are in pants, go to jeans and then buy the black crop jeans they should be number 38 if i'm not mistaken so just look for the black crop jeans so uh, black crop yeah number 38 they still like this number 38 out of 17 jeans so once you guys did that just back out of that and make your way over the tops once you guys make your way over the tops all right so make your way over to leather bomber jackets and then look for the um multicolor essence clothes so just look for the multicolor essence clothes it should be this one number seven out of 19 buy that so it should like this so once you guys did bought that just back out of that and make your way over the shoes make your way over the shoes click right on the d-pad go to high heel boots and then go down to number 24 I think. they called the um, the lexman i combat is number 24 they should have like this so now once you guys did this just back out of that and it's going to be the first outfit that we're going to be making so once you guys made this first outfit head up to the front counter and say this outfit in the first or second slot. I'm gonna save it in the second slot. I'm gonna name it outfit number two. I mean outfit number one. I don't know why it's two. Outfit one. Because it's gonna be the first outfit. So it didn't save for some reason, so let me just retype it. Just type in outfit one. Okay, well, this is. Okay, I'm just put outfit one on the 
sorry. Okay, so once you guys got this outfit back out of that, the next thing you guys want to do is make your way over to tops. So head back over to tops, and then once you guys are on this right here, head over to work jackets, and then buy the peach camo clothes suit. So it should be number 9 out of 17, it looks like this. So buy that. So once you guys bought that, just back out of that, and then make your way over, I'm sorry, back, make your way back to tops, and then go down to tuck t-shirts. So just look for tuck t-shirts. So once you guys are on tuck t-shirts, click, um, you're going to want to look for the blue digital tee. So to look for a blue digital t-shirt, it's somewhere in the bottom, I think. Yeah, the blue digital t-shirt is number 75 and 92. So once you guys have that, just equip this. So you guys should have the, the same outfit, just with a different top. Keep the same pants and the same shoes. So once you guys hit that, head over to the front counter again. And say this outfit on the third slot. So I'm going to name it outfit one again, because it's still to the first outfit. So once you guys made the first outfit, make your way back over to tops and then head over to leather bomber jackets. So look for leather bomber jackets, it should be number 13. So once you guys made your way over to leather bomber jackets, go down to number 13 and then buy the Magneti Leopard, something like that, it's like this. So once you guys bought this, so, um, you're gonna buy this one. So once you guys did that, just back out of that and then make your way over to pants. So I think pants over here. Yeah. So make your way over to pants and then head over to utility pants and then buy the black battle pants. So they should look like this in number 37 out of 38. So once you guys did that, once you guys did that, head make your way over to accessories. Okay. So once you guys made your way over to accessories, head over to gloves and buy the light wallet tactical gloves. You should still have them from the last outfit, so make sure you have them. So once you guys did that, just back out of that and then head up to the front counter and say this outfit. So you say this outfit. You're gonna make sure you leave a gap between every outfit. So this one I'm gonna name it outfit number two. Outfit two. So you guys should have this outfit right here. So once you guys did that, make your way back over to pants. So make your way over to pants and then go to sports pants and buy the spotter muscle pants. It should be number one out of 54. It looks like this. So now once you guys did that, back out of that and then make your way over to tops. Head over to work jackets and buy the peach camo clothes suit. So once you guys bought this, you're gonna want to go down to tuck t-shirts and then buy the blue digital t-shirt. So basically the same component that we did last time. So once you guys did that, just back out of that and then make your way over to shoes. Make your way over to shoes and then go to boots. And then you guys are gonna wanna buy the worn ox blood slack boots. So just look for the worn ox blood slack boots. Just go down. Worn ox blood slack boots. So once you guys did that, just back out of that. And then make your way up to the front counter and say this outfit. So I'm gonna save it right here. So once you guys have this outfit right here, make your way back over to pants, make your way over to pants, click right on the d-pad, and then go to sports pants and buy the spotted muscle pants. So once you guys have that, keep the same top, keep the same gloves, then make your way over to boots, I mean shoes, yeah, make your way to shoes and boots. So make your way to shoes and boots, and then buy the worn ox blood slack boots. So just go down until you find the worn ox blood slack boots, should be number 29. So now once you guys have this, make your way up to the front counter and say this outfit. D-pad. Save this outfit here. I'm gonna save it under outfit two, cause this is the component to the second outfit. Outfit two. So now once you guys did that, back out of that, and then make your way over to tops again. Make your way over to tops and then go down to tuck, um, tuck t-shirts. So look for tuck t-shirts. Okay, tuck t-shirts and then buy the blue jet blue digital camel clothes. I think that's what it's called. Uh, the blue digital t-shirt, yeah, blue digital t-shirt. So once you guys did that, just back out of that and then make your way over to work jackets. Like for work jackets right here. And then buy the peach camel clothes. So once you guys did that, 
make your way up to the front counter and save this outfit again. So save it under outfit two because this is still a component to the second outfit. It's outfit two. It's okay. So once you, you guys are done with outfit two, once you guys made the, these outfits are here. So this is the first one. Wait, this is the first one. This is the second one. This is the third one. So now once you guys get that back out of that, what you guys want to do is make your way over to pants. So make your way over to pants. Click right on the D-pad. And then go to jeans and then buy the black crop. So let's look for the black crop jeans. I think they're number 38. Yeah, the black crop jeans. So now once you guys bought these, all you guys want to do is black back out of that. Now once you guys back out of that, make sure you want to head over to the shoes. Click right on the D-pad on the shoes. Go to high heel boots and then buy the deluxe men like combat. So it should be number 24. We already bought these. So it should be free since we already bought them. So now once you guys got that, back out of that, and then make your way over the tops. So make your way over the tops. Now once you guys are on tops, head over to tactical jackets. So look for tactical jackets. And then you guys are going to want to buy the last one. It's called a khaki tactical blossom. So like that. So buy that one. So once you guys bought that, back out of that, and then head over to bikinis. So look for bikinis. And then you guys are going to want to buy the black bikini. So just look for the black bikini. It should be number 27 out of 30. It looks like this. So just buy it. So now once you guys bought that, back out of that. And then make your way over to accessories. Make your way over to accessories. And then head over to gloves. And then buy the light woolen tactical gloves. They should be number 4. You already have bought them. So... Once you guys did that, back out of that, and then make your way over to the front counter and say this outfit. So say this outfit, make sure to leave a space between all, every outfit. I'm, I'm going to name it outfit 3 because it's the third outfit that we're going to make. So outfit 3. So once you guys did that, back out of that, and then make your way over back over the tops. Keep the same pants, same gloves, and the same shoes. And then head over to work jackets. And then buy the peach camo clothes food. Number nine, it should be number nine and seventeen. It looks like this. We already even bought it before. So once you guys did that, make your way over to Tuck T-shirts and then buy the blue digital T-shirt. So let's look for the blue digital T-shirt. We already have it bought too, so you're not gonna, you don't have to buy it again. Looks like that. So once you guys have this outfit, head back over to the front counter and say this outfit under slot two. I'm under slot three. So I'm gonna name it outfit three. The third outfit all right so once you guys did that you're done with the third outfit the next thing you're gonna do is make your way over to pants again so make your way over to pants and then head over to utility pants and then buy the black battle pants it should be like number 37 or 38 remember we already bought it so now once you guys get that back out of that and then head over to tops and then head over to tank tops so look for tank tops Tank tops, once you guys are on tank tops, click up on a D-pad and look for the two-tone tank. It should be number 94 out of 99. It's free, so you don't have to worry, you don't gotta worry about buying it. So now once you guys bought the two-tone tank, the next thing you guys are gonna want to do is back out of that and then head over to leather jackets. So head over to leather jackets. So look for leather jackets. Leather jackets and then buy the blue JC jacket. So just look for the blue JC jacket. So make sure it's not the the logo jacket because the logo jacket does give you a different one. Make sure it's just the blue JC jacket. So it's number 32. Looks like this. So make sure it's that one. So now once you guys bought that, just back out of that. So back out of that. So back out of tops. And then the next thing you want to do. So once you guys took off the gloves, make your way over the pants. And then equip the spotter muscle pants. Go to sports pants and then go to number one and quit the spot of pants. So now once you guys did that, make your way over to shoes and then head over to high heel boots. Get around a D-pad, head over to high heel boots and then buy number 24. They call it the Lex Midnight Combat. So now once you guys did that, head up to the front counter and say this outfit. This is the fourth outfit that we're gonna be making. So save it on the fourth. So outfit number four.
So once you guys made your way over to bus tiers, and by the white bus tier, is number 22 out of 33. So buy that. So now once you guys bought that, just back out of that. So now once you guys have the white bus tier, make sure to take off the jacket. So now once you guys did that, make your way over to uh, hats. Click right on the D-pad and then head over to canvas hats. So it should be at the top. And then you guys, I want to buy the gray plate canvas hat. Select this, number 78 out of 79. So now once you guys did that, just back out of that. And then you guys, I want to head over to glasses. So make your over to glasses and then go to casual glasses, I think. And then buy the copper marble. I think it's casual glasses. So yeah, just look for the copper marble glasses. Copper marbles, yeah. It's number 22 out of 45. So now once you guys have that, just back out of that and then make your way over to the front counter and save this outfit again. So save it under the outfit 4. It's going to be the 4th outfit. It's going to be another component to the 4th outfit. So now once you guys have that, just back out of that and then make your way over to pants. So make your way over to pants, click around the d-pad, sports pants, and then buy number 1 out of 54 to call it spotter muscle pants. So now once you guys have that, head over to tops, work jackets. And then buy the peach camo clothes field. Back out of there and then make your way over to tuck t-shirts and then buy the blue digital t-shirt. The blue digital t-shirt. So just look for it. It's somewhere around the bottom. If you guys remember we bought it already. So it's kind of blue digital t-shirt. Buy that and then back out of that. So once you guys did that, make your way over to shoes again. And then head over to high heel boots. And then buy number 24. They call it the deluxe man I come back. So now once you guys did that, head up to the front counter and then save this outfit again. So save this outfit under outfit 4. Okay, so we're almost done with the outfits. Outfit 4. So something I forgot to tell you guys to do. So head back over to outfit number 4 and then equip uh, the gloves and then buy the light wool intact gloves. So equip them for both outfits. So make sure you equip it. Then I'm gonna get the other outfit too. There's something I forgot. It should be this one, and then it cooked the gloves again. So once you guys save the fourth outfit, we're gonna be making the fifth outfit. So the first thing you guys want to do is head over to tops, and then head over to tuck t-shirts. So make your way over to tuck t-shirts. And then you guys are gonna want to go down until you find the black, the, the black tuck T-shirt. So it's called the black classic. So look for the black classic. So I think I passed it up. Yeah, I think I did. So look for it. So the black classic. So now once you guys have bought that, just back out of that, and then head back over to tops, and then go to denim jackets, and then buy the distressed denim jacket. It's number nine out of seventeen. It should like this. So now once you guys bought that back out of that and then make your way over to pants, click around the D-pad and then head over to leather jack, I mean leather pants, leather pants and then go down to number 19 and then buy the red ribbon. So now once you guys bought that, just back out of that and then make your way over to shoes. Make your way over to shoes, click around the D-pad and then head over to high hoop boots and equip the deluxe midnight combat. You should have them equipped it already. So now once you guys did that, make your way over to accessories, gloves, and then buy the light wool and tactic gloves. You should have them from the last outfit. So now once you guys have this outfit, just head over to the front counter. Wait, I forgot to take off this. So make sure to take off this, these hats and uh, glasses from the last outfit. So I'm going to take them off. So now once you guys hit that head up to the front counter and say this outfit and under outfit number 5. So this is going to be the 5th and final outfit that we're going to be making. Outfit 5. So now once you guys hit that, back out of that and then make your way over to tops. And then head over to tactical jackets. And then you guys are going to buy the khaki tactical blouse soon. It's number 79 out of 79 so it's the last one. Now once you guys did that, just back out of that and then make your way over to party tank tops. So just look for party tank tops. And once you guys hit that, you guys are gonna want to buy the loot leopard loose tank. It's number one out of twelve. So now once you guys hit that, back out of that, and then make your way up to the front counter. And this is the last outfit that we gotta make. So I'm gonna say an outfit That's number five again. Outfit five. So 
so once you guys have all these outfits right here as you guys can see make sure they're the exact same as mine so these are this is the first outfit is the second outfit is the third outfit is the fourth outfit yeah this third outfit fourth outfit this is the fifth outfit so make sure all of them have the exact same stuff that I have so the gloves everything the exact same besides this outfit here make sure it doesn't have gloves so make sure all these other outfits have gloves and stuff so now once you guys have all these outfits what you guys want to do is open up your interaction menu and just take the easy way out so just kill yourself you player should just take a pill or something and just overdose and die So now once you guys had took the easy way out, what you want to do is hit, click pause, head over to online, and go down to creator. So once you guys are on the screen right here, as you guys can see, it gives you like a menu. Go to create a race, create a land race. Create a land race and then click pause and then place a waypoint over here at the airport. Place it like exactly where I put, not exactly where I placed it up, but like around where I placed it at, like the back of the airport. So uh, race details, you're gonna put a title, just put a title, description, put a description, doesn't matter. Photo, take a picture. So route type, make sure it's point to point, that way you don't have to be doing laps, just back and forth, back and forth, that's why it's just point to point one time, that's all you gotta do. Placement, place the trigger like, uh, I'm placing it like back here place trigger lobby camera take a picture so checkpoints here's like the important part of the glitch so you're going to go all along this um, landing strip until you hit 0.71 at my so you can just go in a straight line you can do turns curves it doesn't matter but make sure it's at 0.71 at my because if it's not at 0.71 at my then this glitch will not work for you then it'll just like mess up the glitch so this is the important part of the glitch so just keep going until you hit 0.71 am I? I'm almost there, I'm at 51 am I? So here I'm gonna take a turn so it doesn't matter if you take a turn. Okay. So once you guys are at 0.71 am I, I'm almost there. Let's see two. 0.71 am I just back out of that and test the race. So you guys are just gonna want to complete the race. So I'll be back once I'm done with the race. So once you guys are done with the race, it's going to give you this alert. Just click X or A if you're on Xbox. Then click pause, head over to online, and then go down to choose character. So once you guys are on the screen right here, as you guys can see, we're back on the screen where we started at. we we'll swap characters. So what you guys want to do is head over to your second slot character and then delete all the outfits. I mean, delete the um, delete your female character, the one that we made all the outfits on. That's why I said all the outfits earlier. So just type in delete. So now once you guys hit that, all you guys want to do is just back out of that. So click circle or B. So just back out of that and return to store mode. So I'll be back once I'm in store mode. So once you guys are in store mode, what you guys want to do is click pause head over to online and just find a public session or environment session so I just join the online session so I'll be back once I'm in the session so once you guys spawn into an online session what you guys want to do is open up your interaction menu and hover over the outfits so you should see we have all the components to the outfits so what you guys want to do is back out of that and then make your way over to the nearest clothing store or gun store it doesn't matter so I'm gonna make my way over to the gun store because it's right down the street So just drive over there, make your way over there, it doesn't matter. So you guys should be back on your main character, which should be the male character. So, yeah. So once you guys make your way over to the gun store, clothing store, it doesn't matter. Head inside and save your current outfit. So I'm going to save my outfit right here in the bottom. Save it on the bottom. I'm going to save it under... Mm, just going to put you up. So now once you guys save your outfit, what you So once you guys save your outfit, make your way over to outfits. So head over to outfits 
and then head over to racing suit i think that's no body wait no they call it racing suit i think all right biker suit yeah bike head over to bike suits i'm sorry head over to bike suits and then buy the black biker suit so now once you guys did that click pause head over to online go to play jobs play uh play jobs rockstar created versus and start crooked cop So once you guys are on the screen right here, make sure closing is on player own because if it's not on player own, then this glitch will not work for you. It won't let you merge the uh, components. So now once you guys did that, just invite a friend or just invite a random so I'll be back once I got somebody to join me. So once you guys got people to join the job, all you want to do is click play on the job. So now once you guys are on the screen here, go one time to the right and one more time to the right and you should have this outfit right here as you guys can see. And you guys are just going to want to ready up. So once you guys are on the screen here, what you guys want to do, you should have this modern outfit already. So it's the galaxy top, the biker gloves and the checkerboard pants and the paramedic belt. So the next thing you guys want to do is open up your interaction menu, head over to style, accessory, equip the earpiece, and just quit the job to your phone. So pull up your phone and just quit the job. So once you guys did all that, it should load you back into a, um, st um, st uh, it should load you back into an online session. So you're just gonna want to wait until it loads you back into an online session. So once you guys spawn into the online session, what you guys want to do is head over to the nearest gun store or clothing store. It doesn't matter. Well, for me, it's the gun store because it's right down the street. So make your way inside and head over and save your current outfit. So head inside and just save your current outfit. So I'm going to save this one under merged one. So now once you guys hit that, head over to the, uh, the first components and delete them. So now once you guys hit that, the next thing you guys want to do is head over to tops. Head over to racing jerseys. And you guys are gonna want to head, head down to number eight, and they, they should, I mean, not number eight, I'm sorry. Head over to, I think, yeah, number eight. And it's called the uh, Salas, I can't say the name, but they're basically the pink and blue gloves. So now, once you guys did that, what you guys wanna do is click pause, head over to online, jobs, play jobs, rocks are created, and start Cricket Cop again. You guys should know what to do. So, start Cricket Cop. So once you guys are on this screen right here, just, just gotta wait. Make sure it's on clothing, uh, clothing on player own. You guys should know this already. So once it's on player own, what you guys wanna do is confirm settings and just invite a friend. So I'll be back once I got somebody to join me. So once you guys got somebody to join, all you wanna do is click play on the job. So you're gonna want to wait until the job loads. Could take a while. So once you guys are on the screen here, go one time to the right and one more time to the right. Wait, so it's kind of glitched for me for some reason. So one time to the right and then one more time to the right and you should have this so it's this uh bodysuit with the gloves and the cop belt and the black joggers so you're gonna want to wait so once you guys spawn in you should have this outfit here it's like a little neon outfit ish yeah so now once you guys did that, you want to do the same thing, you just open up your interaction menu, style, accessories, equip the earpiece, and just quit the job to your phone. So once you guys save the outfit, head over to outfits, and then head over to biker suits. So make your way over to biker suits, and equip the black biker suit. 
So now once you guys hit that, all you guys want to do is start cooking up again. So you guys know what to do, so I don't gotta explain it to y'all. So just start cooking cup. So once you guys are on the screen here, make sure the clothing is on player owned. So now once you guys hit that, just invite a friend. So I'll be back once I get somebody to join me. So once you guys got people to join, all you want to do is click play on the job. So once you guys are on the screen here, go one time to the right, one more time to the right, and you should have the invisible torso with the biker gloves. So now once you guys did that, all you guys want to do is wait for the other people to ready up. Because I'm not waiting. So you guys should have this outfit so the next thing you guys want to do once you guys spawn into the mission is open up your interaction menu and equip the earpiece as we'll be doing all the other outfits so equip the earpiece now once you guys hit that all you guys want to do is just quit the job to your phone so once you guys spawn into an online session just make your way over to the there's gun store clothing store doesn't matter so for me the gun store is right down the street and hit inside and save your current outfit. So make sure you save the components at the bottom. So I don't have no more space, so I'm gonna delete this outfit and save it on the merge three. Oh, let's just merge, let it rename. So now once you guys did that, what you guys wanna do is back out of that and make sure you delete the components to the outfit that we just did. So outfit number three, make sure to delete those components. So we only left with two more outfits to do. So next thing you guys want to do is just click pause and start cricket cop again. So jobs, play jobs, rockstar created, versus, and start cricket cop. So now once you guys are on the screen, make sure your clothing is on player own. So now once you guys did that, just invite a friend or a random. So I'll be back once I got somebody to join me. So once you guys got somebody to join, what you guys gonna do is just click play on the job. So once you guys are on the screen here, Go one time to the right and you should have this. So now once you guys have that, just click ready. So you're just gonna wanna wait for the other person to ready up. So that's what it's gonna be giving us right here. It's gonna be giving us the um it's gonna be giving us the racing gloves that we're gonna be able to put onto the outfit. So you're gonna wanna wait for the other person to ready up. Just take forever. So once you guys um, are in the screen here, you should have like this, the top, you see how it has like the top. It doesn't matter what the pants are because those are going to change later on. So what you guys need to do is equip the earpiece and just quit the job to your phone. So the same thing we'll be doing. So you guys should spawn into the online session. So you're going to want to wait until you spawn into the online session. So once you guys spawn into the online session, what you guys are going to want to do is make your way over to the nearest clothing store. So just make your way over to the nearest clothing store. 
So once you guys made your way over to the nearest clothing store, head inside and then head over to accessories. So let me make my way over there. So once you guys are on accessories, head over to gloves and you guys need to find the black uh, biker gloves. So I think that's what it's called. No, they're called racing gloves. So cut the racing gloves and you guys should have like this. And then what you guys, once you guys did that, you guys are gonna delete the first component and just delete it. So once you guys did that, uh, click pause and start Crooked Cop. So once you guys are on the screen here, make sure the code is on player owned. So now once you guys did that, confirm settings and just invite a friend. So once you guys got some people to join, all you want to do is just start off the mission. So once you guys are on the screen here, go one time to the right and one more time to the right and you should have this, the black joggers, the checkerboard top and the race gloves. And you guys are just going to want to wait for the other people to ready up. So once you guys are on this screen here, as you guys can see, after we merged, what you guys want to do is open up your interaction menu. So open up your interaction menu, style, accessories, equip the earpiece, and quit the job to your phone. So once you guys spawn into a session after you guys have merged all the outfits and stuff, what you guys want to do is head up to the, head back over to the gun shop or clothing store, doesn't matter, and just save your current outfit. So it should be this, the black joggers and the checkerboard. Honestly, one of my favorite outfits from doing this glitch. So I'm gonna save it under Merge 4. I'm gonna save it under Merge 4. Merged 4. So once you guys did that, delete the components. So what you guys, um, what you guys wanna do next is just click pause. Actually, no, don't click pause. Head over to tops and then head over to um racing jerseys and equip the pump motocross so now once you guys did that click pause head over to online go to jobs play jobs rockstar created versus and start cricket cop again so this is going to be the last outfit that we're going to be making so that's kind of um, a big yay pretty happy so once you guys are on the screen here make sure you have clothing on player owned again so once you guys did that, all you guys want to do is just invite a friend or a random. So I'll be back once I get somebody to join me. So once you guys got some people to join you, all you want to do is click play on the job. So all you guys want to do is go one time to the right and just click ready, ready to play. You're just going to want to wait for other people to ready up. So the white shirt is not supposed to be there, it's supposed to be invisible, but uh, I don't know where I messed up, so yeah, I apologize. So now once you guys had this outfit and you spawn into the mission or whatever, what you guys want to do is open up your interaction menu, head over to style, accessories, equip the earpiece, and just quit the job to your phone. So once you guys spawn into the online session, what you guys want to do is make your way over down to the gun store, clothing store, it doesn't matter. And just go inside and save your current outfit. So there should be this. This is not how it's supposed to be, but it doesn't look bad overall. So I'm going to just save it under Trash Fist. Trash Fist. So now once you guys did that, you can delete the components to the other outfit. I mean to the outfit that we just did. So delete. So other than that, that's the 
you should have all all your modern, modern outfits, all the five modern outfits. So other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to drop a like, subscribe, comment, turn on the post notifications, and leave a comment down below if you enjoy most of the modern outfits and if I should make some more. But other than that, I'll see you guys in the next video.